हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज़ अंकित एंड वेलकम्स यू ऑल इन द चैनल ऑफ कोडिंग वर्ड्स ऑनलाइन सो इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ यू कैन इंटीग्रेट द रेजर पे पेमेंट गेटवे इन कोडिंग नाइटर आप यू ऑल नो द रेजर पे पेमेंट गेटवे इज़ अ पेमेंट गेटवे दैट प्रोवाइड्स इट्स सर्विस इन इंडिया एज वेल एज फॉर रिसीविंग और एक्सेप्टिंग द इंटरनेशनल पेमेंट ऑल्सो Uh, now we will talk about how we will integrate it so in many tutorials you will find the how to integrate this in normal php core php or browser pay payment gateway itself provides his kit of php to integrate in core php so the task i am going to uh, perform that is how to integrate it in code igniter we are in going to integrate in code igniter Coding that is the framework you all know. So let me show you just a demo. Uh, suppose I have created this is a simple HTML form. The task we are going to do do is when I will fill that form and submit, you will get a payment screen and you will make the payment as you all do. This is just a dummy amount. Don't don't just think. about it i have set some amount in back end okay let me show you just a demo see what happens this this comes the payment uh, screen provided by the pay, razor pay so here are many option card upi and banking wallet whatever you want you can do that if you want to do with the mobile number or whatever there are the things Again. Let me select the suppose I am selecting the net banking, or you can select from here a check any bank. This is just the <coughs> dummy, okay? So uh, when you click on success or failure, you will get some result. For example, we are clicking on the success. After that, this payment is success. okay i haven't saved i have not saved the detail of the customer in database so i have just created a function and array from where we you can store to the database i will show you just a code okay first of all you have to uh, just enter some keys here your api keys define constant after that just create a html form like this this is just a uh, just go to the view this is your coordinate project application views uh, inside the view just create this i will provide the source code don't worry yes you have to just make copy and paste so this is just a form and for this we need a controller Con for which controller we have created that is register.php okay the in the, we all know the by default index function is called then we just load the registration form view so that our uh, this page is get loaded after that when when we submit this form okay when we submit it this comes to the register plus pay function this is the pay function here we have received the api keys and this is the amount from this is the comment you can read also we have just set some amount that is 10 rupees and this is the just a uh, config array and here is the function prepare data this amount and payment id prepare data prepare data is for the razor pay the pay, the payment screen you seen that receives some data that we are preparing here and this will return to the that function from where it is called this and we we, we have created a Razor Pay view that was get loaded when we just selected net banking and all. So this is the Razor Pay. You have to just copy and paste it. Okay. After that, when that payment screen get loaded, uh, then we click on Success. Then this function is called Verify. See, this is going to register slash Verify. this function just verifies whether the, this payment is valid or not or is there any error or not try catch also is there 
after that if everything is fine then we have just prepared the registration data if you want to save it to database this is just registration data you just need to call like a dollar query request to dollar this db arrow insert and just pass the table name and this data array you will get this data to be saved in your database okay and after that uh, we have just redirected to success page if payment fails occurs then we have redirected it to payment failed okay this is just a very simple code and you just don't need to worry about it uh, i will give you the source code link in description from where you can find out you can also check my blog that is codingworldsonline.com see the internet it is was slow that's why it took time this is the same uh, the thing I have uh, uh, covered in the video you can find this blog also the same thing is explained here same processes are explained what you have to do what files need to be created and you just need to copy and paste this code uh, I have given some screenshot also and from if you want the, to download the source code and click here and you will get the github link from here you can copy all the code whatever you want okay thanks for watching and please subscribe like subscribe and comment the coding words online youtube channel and if you have any error or any problem just comment out i will answer them thanks for watching